lovelies it's lex and i thought that we would check in on sasha and jared and see how they're doing for our little sims let's play here i'm gonna go ahead and jared uh have jared make some brunchy breakfast for everybody while sasha goes up and takes a shower and gets ready to start her day as well uh, let's see what she wants to do. Make something of excellent quality and she wants to become inspired. Well, she can definitely become inspired because she's going to be working on her painting per usual uh, because that is her goal is to uh, be the painter extraordinaire for her um, life want here. So she still wants to do three emotional paintings. So maybe I can have her uh, get an emotion here. I know I have some of these cute little guys hanging around. So why don't we enable that aura and then have her come down here and see if that helps with her um, getting an emotion so that we can have her do that. So Jared was just working on his cooking skill a little bit. He's not really hungry, but he needed to do a little bit of cooking um, so that he can hopefully uh, get better at his job here. So I guess I'm going to go ahead and have him go ahead and use the toilet and take a shower and just, you know, get ready for his day at work. Oh, she's playful. Awesome. Okay, so Sasha, why don't you come over here and make a playful painting? I still love her little outfit. Um, for some reason, I don't know why my game is doing this. I know that, it did, that they just patched it the other day, so that may be why. Um, the reason that this is starting with them in a different position that they were in, um, I have no idea why. The last video, I had them like go to bed, and that was the end of the video. When I loaded their lot to start playing this, um, they were out in front of their house, and I have no idea why they were just like chilling out in front of their house, but whatever. It's okay. I'm hoping you can hear them. I was doing a little recording earlier. Um, and I was just trying to like test everything to make sure that everything was recording Banana. properly and it like wasn't recording my desktop sound. So hopefully you can hear Jared singing a little bit there. Um, he's really tired, uh, because of that weird glitch my game had where they just started out in front of their house. It woke them up when I didn't tell them to wake up and just like a weird, I don't even know. And then it started with it being 10 o'clock in the morning and we, f when we ended off last time, it would have been, I don't know. 11 o'clock at night in game so i don't have any idea what is going on oh look at your little beach ball painting that's pretty cute but we're gonna sell it do, 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 do. yay milestone complete okay sell your painting all right so let's see what her new milestone is she wants to view or admire three paintings at the museum and then complete 10 excellent paintings oh that's good okay so probably while jared is at work then um, I'm going to go ahead and have Sasha go to the museum. So we have something to do with her today. When do you start work? You start work in two hours, but you're okay. You can just sleep a little bit, Sierra. Oh, oh. Let's see how cute she is. Oh, she is so cute. So cute. I don't know that that necessarily looks like fruit salad. It looks like globby pink. I guess that's like a blueberry. I don't know. Fast mode for me. I like can't play this game in slow motion. All right, come down here and talk to your wife because she's lonely. Go get to know your wife and just and 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 do an inside joke with her. She likes you. Okay, talk. What are you doing? Talk to her. Oh my God. Just. Hey, lady. What's going on? Mm. Ask about her day. How's your day? It's good? Okay, bye. I have to go to work. Okay, so as soon as it says that he's at work, okay, he's at work. So let's go ahead and have Sasha do a little traveling here, and we'll have her go to the museum so that she can do what she wants to do. And you're going by yourself. Oh, that Jeff, was that Jeffrey Langrab? He's like obsessed with Sasha, and I always forget about it. I don't know, I don't know why. He like calls her constantly and wants her to like go out with him and stuff. And it's really weird because I'm pretty sure he's married. Um, I'm playing a new crest. I don't have it like set up so that there's a museum and a bar and like all that kind of fun stuff. So we'll just go to the museum that's over here. Oh my goodness. I wonder if you can hear my kitty cats playing in the background. We, um, Strider is no longer, like, in kitty quarantine, I guess is the best way to describe it. He's big enough to, like, handle himself now, so we're letting him roam around the house. And the kitties are starting to get along better, which is really nice. They'll actually play together now and sleep together and, you know, do cute little kitty cat things, which is nice. So they're like a little, little kitty family. So, it's so sweet, little kitty family. 
All right, we're at the museum. Okay, so what does she want to do? She wants to admire, view or admire three paintings at the museum. Okay, well, we are at the museum. So let's go in and look for some paintings. Oh, here's some paintings. Okay, why don't you go ahead and come over here and view this painting. Oh, what do you think? Do you like it? Let's see how what her reaction is. What do you think, Sasha? Is it beautiful? Is it a beautiful painting? Who is that child? Why are you here by yourself? Don't talk to that kid. That's weird. You're supposed to be looking at paintings. You don't know that kid. Oh, that's kind of... I don't like that. Stop talking to children that you don't know. All right, we're done. Okay, so she wants to complete 10 excellent paintings. Maybe there's like an easel somewhere here. Oh, I should have brought hers with her, and then we could have, like, had her do a little painting here. I don't think there are any, at least not in the museum. Oh, why don't we have her come over here and, like, do some stuff? Okay, go ahead and do this. Why don't you look for a froggy? What's that? Snapdragon. We don't want that. That's poopy. What are you? A rose? Eh. What are you? Strawberry? Oh, you're not, you're not harvestable. You're not ready. What are you? A pear? Oh, that's not harvestable either. And you're a flower. Do we have anything good here? I don't know. Where'd she go? Just do what I tell you, woman. <laughs> oh, we found a ruby. Cool. Anything in there? A sunflower frog. That sounds cute. Ugh, is that Jeffrey? No, that's somebody. I don't know who that is. Are you anything good? No, just snapdragons. There's like nothing, nothing we want. Cause since, um, oh, we can't harvest that. Since Jared is um, a chef, I was hoping we would be able to like maybe get some ingredients for him. So we can get some of this stuff though. I mean, it's not really, we don't really have to because I'm not, I'm not necessarily trying to complete any of the collections, but I'm not not trying to complete the collections, if that makes sense. I wonder if, like, I had Jared come here at some point and harvest all this stuff. I don't think I did, though. Because he would have just been harvesting around their house. I don't know. Whatever. Alright, you do your thing, and then we're gonna go back home. Oh, look at her, like, a little fast runny here. So funny. Get all these frogglies. Okay, that's enough. Go home. She's gonna go home. I miss having open world so freaking much. Like, it's not even funny how much I miss it. Like, I mean, my load screens aren't that bad, but it just upsets me that it's not, that it's not open world anymore like it was in 3. But like a lot of other people, I did have a lot of problems with lag and I did have a lot of problems with the game freezing and having extremely long load times when you were going to go start playing the game in three because of it being open world. So like, I understand why they did it. Um, oh, they have to pay their bills. I, I, where I do understand why they did it. I really, really wish that, that they hadn't and that it was still, um, that it was still open world because it's just like crap. I don't know. Like, I feel like it's so lame to not be open world anymore when they were doing it before. So like, you know that they're capable of doing it, you know, it's not, it's not like they're incapable of doing it. So I feel like it's, it's really frustrating that you know that they're able to do something and then they just don't do it. I don't know. As I ramble on now, I don't have anywhere to put these cute little frogglies. I don't want to put them on the floor. I guess we could put one in the kitchen. I don't know how I would feel about that, though. Like, if I had a frog in my kitchen. <laughs> I like frogs, though. I think frogs would be maybe, like, a semi-interesting pet. We have hermit crabs because we're lame. <laughs> I would love to get, like, a snake or something like that. But um, my dad is, like, mortally afraid of snakes. Like, seriously, seriously terrified of snakes. And, I mean, we don't live together anymore. But I know that he would never want to come over to my house if he knew that there was a snake here. Like, as lame as that is, I know that he wouldn't. He would just be like, no, I'm not coming to your house. It's full of snakes. 
And it's so funny because he's like a big dude. Like my dad's like a, he's like a big guy, and it's it's not something that you necessarily associate with like bigger tough guys like being afraid of snakes and just like not liking slimy things in general. But that's how he is. He's just not into it. It's not his thing. Not his thing. <laughs> probe. <laughs> a probe. Look at my grilled cheese. It's so great. What are these? Oh, you got fossils. Why are you, like, standing in front of the fridge like a fatty McFatterson eating your grilled cheese? <laughs> oh, man. Well, she's tired. All right, so eat your grilled cheese and then go to bed. We don't want to look at you anymore, you and your uh, grilled cheese. We're over you. Well, she only made one painting today, which is kind of bleh, because she's sort of like... Oh, that painting sold for a lot, though. Okay, so Jared's home from work. He wants to pee... Uh, he really just wants to, like, get a promotion. Um, I don't really have him, like, he doesn't have anything he's super interested in. Except doing some cooking and, you know, getting a promotion. But he just want to make a group meal. So why don't we have you do that and then we'll have you go to bed. So you get a little bit of uh, experience here with your cooking. Oh, and then he's off for the next three days. So that's nice. I'll get to spend some time with his wife, who's very lonely, apparently. Oh. I don't know why. Well, I guess she was home alone all day. All right, there you go. I guess go eat and then put that away and then you'll go to bed. Like, you're not buying a chef's station. You freaking live here. You don't need one. We just did that. You just made a group meal. All right, put that away. Go to bed. I wonder if it's having them, like go out in front of the house whenever I start the game because I'm, like, going into other lots and stuff, and it's, like, confusing it. I guess that's a possibility. But I guess I'm going to end this video here. Have a wonderful rest of your day, guys. I hope you're enjoying these Let's Plays with Sasha and Jared. They're such a cutie pie couple. Hopefully they'll have enough money soon um, that we can maybe have them have a baby or, or do something a little more interesting than just, like, you know, go to work and go to the museum and be boring. Um, but have a wonderful afternoon. Leave a like, subscribe, leave me a comment. Let me know if you guys enjoy these videos, if you hate them, if you want more, if you want a different family, if you want them to go do something specific in the game, please tell me and I will try to accommodate you. Have a wonderful rest of your day, guys.